Hello, welcome back to Friday Fun. My name is Christine and today I'm going to show you how to make two crafts with paper plates. The first one is this paper plate fish and the second one is the spider. So let's get started. Paper plate fish, you're going to need some construction paper, um, a paper plate, any size will work, some glue, um, a paint color of your choice, paintbrush, any kind of writing utensil, and some scissors. So you're going to want to make sure to cover your surface with newspaper or any uh, type of scrap paper. I have a placemat that I'm going to use um, just because it's going to get a little bit messy. Okay, and next take your color of choice and just begin painting your plate. Um, I flip mine over. And depending on um, what color you choose, you may need to do um, a couple coats. And then once when you have it fully painted, you can go ahead and put it to the side to dry. Next, take your choice of construction paper for the fish's scale. Um, I, I want mine to be really colorful, so I chose all the colors. And then I'm just going to put them all together just so it's easier to um, cut and trace. And then I'm going to take my paint bottle and I'm going to trace circles. And then I'm going to take my scissors and cut out that strip. And you can also cut them individually as well. It's up to you. Um, I'm just going to do it this way just because it's easier for me. And then once when you have the strip, you can begin cutting your circles. And then once when you have all your cutout circles, you're just going to want to take each one and just fold them. Um, this will give the um, fish's scales that, like a 3D effect. Okay, and then for the fish's eye, I'm just going to again take my paint and I'm going to trace a circle. Or if you have googly eyes, you can use that as well. And then once I have my circle, I'm going to draw a little circle inside it for the eyeball. And then I'm just going to color it inside. And then I'm going to take my scissors and I'm going to cut that out. And then I'm going to put that to the side as well. Okay, so once when your paper plate is dry, you're going to take it and you're going to make two slits um, for it to form a triangle. And this is going to be the fish's tail and mouth. And then once when you have it, you're just going to put that aside because we're going to attach it later for the tail. Okay, so I'm going to take the eye that I just made and I'm going to attach it to the fish. Just make sure that the paint is completely dry before you do this step. And then I'm going to start placing my scales as well. So on one side, you're just going to want to add the glue. And then... Place it however you want. I'm trying to go for like a rainbow effect, so I'm going to do it um, as the rainbow colors. And then the last step is just adding glue to the top of the triangle and then attaching it to the back of the plate and this will act as the uh, as the tail. And then you also just want to hold it for a few seconds just to make sure that it fully sticks. Okay. And then 
just like that. And then there's your paper plate fish. For this spider craft, you're gonna need a paper plate, some googly eyes, or you can make them how I showed you in the last craft, um, some paint, a paintbrush, and then some pipe cleaners. I want my spider to be black, so I'm just gonna take my black paint and begin painting the back of the plate. And then once when you have it fully painted, just put it aside to dry. So next take your um, pipe cleaners and these are gonna be the legs for the spider and I'm just gonna cut them in half. You can cut them individually or together, it's up to you. And then put those to the side and take your paper plate and you're just gonna start cutting holes. I forgot to mention in the intro that you're gonna need a hole puncher. You can use a single hole puncher or you can uh, use the uh, three the three hole one. So on each side, just make four holes. One, two, three, four. And then do the same thing on the other side. Also, if you don't have a hole puncher, you can also use scissors and cut a hole um, with the scissors. And then you're gonna wanna take your uh, pipe cleaners and just put, uh, put them through the hole. And then next you're gonna wanna add the eyes. Um, so I'm using googly eyes, but you can also draw the eyes or make them. Just gonna put a bit of glue. And then for the final touch, I'm just gonna get my white paint and dip it into there with the paintbrush and I'm just gonna make a smiley face. And then there you have it, there's your spider.